that's happening unconsciously all the time is something in your brain called the RAS system, the reticular activating system. It's almost as strange as neuro-linguistic programming, but not quite. <laughs> now, the RAS is the part of your brain that sorts for information. So if you've had that experience of perhaps making a major purchase, buying a car, and once you've bought your car, have you noticed that you drive around and you keep seeing your car everywhere? It's like they're all over the road. This is your race system, and it's just that it's still running, even though you don't need to keep looking for a car anymore. It hasn't caught up with the fact that, yep, you've got the car. Now, when you're setting goals, and with yourself or your team, kind of having a sense of what those goals look like, putting them on paper and putting them on the wall, activates your RAS system because it is running 24-7, even while you're asleep, which is why when you wake up in the morning at 4 a.m. and something pops into your head you've been trying to remember the days, that was your RAS system, and it's been working the whole time while you've been busy brushing your teeth, going to work, going to the kids, whatever you've been doing. So all of these functions in your brain are at your disposal if you know they're there and if you know how to use them. One of my favourite quotes about purpose and life comes from Gandhi. He said, be the change you want to see in the world. You've probably heard it. And I say, be the change you want to see in your life. Be the change you want to see in your business. Be the change you want to see in your relationships, your health. By using your brain on purpose, and you can. There is a plethora of information about how to do this in life. And so I invite you to go on that journey and transform the way you work inside and therefore change your world outside. Thanks for listening, folks.